Hello and welcome to Brinsham Green School. I'm Miss Marquis and I'm Deputy Head Teacher at Brinsham. I've probably met a number of you as you've come round on one of my Brinsham live tours and it would be really nice if I was welcoming you in now into an induction day or two but unfortunately due to Covid we're not able to do that. So we're doing this instead. We've got a virtual tour of the school for you and I hope you can enjoy that. Right, if you want to follow me, I'm going to take you to main reception. Okay, this is main reception. So if your parents or a visitor is coming into school, this is the way they come in. Come on in. Okay, looks a bit strange at the moment because of the COVID measures that we've got in place. But you probably recognise this from your first visit into Brinsham. This is our main reception. And as we said, we've got Mr. Pemberthy on the reception desk at the moment. He's there if a parent were to come into school or if you parent needs to drop something off for you, anything like that, that's where they come. Now, we like to have a special reception area just for you so that if there were to be anything you needed you would know exactly where to go so i'm going to take you now to your own reception area you are the most important people in bridgeship so this is the reception area that's just for you for students and there's always somebody there who will be ready to help you or to answer any questions you might have. Okay, come on in. Photos on the side, it might be your mum and dad or somebody you know. And then this way, somebody you really need to know. Hello, I'm Miss Wilmot. You'll find me here on student reception. Um, I'm here to help you if you've got any queries. If I can't personally help you, I will find somebody who can. Um, you'll also find the heads of house all sat down here if you should need them at all throughout your day in school. Okay, I look forward to meeting you. Hello, my name is Mrs. Salis and I'm student support for Dearly and Laderbrook. Hello, I'm Miss Maddox and I'm student support for Hawkesbury and Acton. And we're here to help with your pastoral care or your well-being. We look forward to seeing you in September. Hello there, my name's Mrs. Wiltshire and I'm here if you need anybody to talk to about anything that you're worried about and looking forward to seeing you in September. You will know that coming to, Brin to Brinsham is much more than just going to lessons. There is way more about belonging to Brinsham than just your lessons. For example, chickens. There are so many enrichment opportunities in Brinsham, all different sorts, but one of my favourites is to be in Chicken Club. In Chicken Club you can help take care of our chicken, you can make sure that chicken's got water and food each day and that it's taken care of and you can collect the chicken eggs and that might be something that you will enjoy having as part of your time in Brinsham. All sorts of other things, because you could be in Lego club, you could be in um, one of the study centre clubs, you could be involved in drama or sports or music. There's all sorts of things that are part of this Brinton community and that you will enjoy getting involved in. Now, I'm going to take you round to Humanities. Entrance to humanities. I'm a humanities teacher and I really enjoy seeing you for humanities lessons. All our humanities lessons take place in this block, the humanities block, and while you're in humanities lessons, you'll spend um, a term doing some history, a term doing some geography, a term doing some religious studies. And in those lessons, we've got so many fantastic topics that we can't wait to share with you. I know you're going to really enjoy. Uh, hello Year 6, my name is Mr Hansford, I am the Head of Sixth Form here. Uh, I also teach Geography and I teach Humanities in Year 7 and 8. Uh, and I am now going to deliver you over to the Languages block, so if you want to come this way. Uh, welcome.
welcome to Languages. Willkommen bei uns hier in Brimsham Green Schule. Mein Name ist Herr Norris. Wir lernen Deutsch und Französisch hier. Salut, je m'appelle Madame Britton. Je suis prof de français et allemand. On commence avec le français en septembre. Hallo, ich heiße Frau Spacey. Wir lernen Deutsch im Februar. Bis bald! That was languages, and now we'll head to the study centre. Hello, nice to see you. Oh, welcome to the study centre. Would you like to borrow a book? Choice. That's brilliant! Angie Thomas, the author of this book, uh, is a great author and this book at the moment is in our book group awards, so great! Fantastic! I'll tell you what as well, since you are obviously really keen on libraries, you might like to borrow some of our films as well. We can loan you films, books, all sorts of things from here. Um, and if you really, really like films, which lots of people do, you can join our film club. It's a free club, runs after school on a Wednesday, free squash and popcorn as well. Lots of really, really nice things. Um, you can come in here also at break and lunchtime, okay? We've got over here, we've got our non-fiction area where you can do your homework. And we are open after school. If you want to catch up with your homework and get it done before you go home, we can do that. And um, you also, that lovely room that you went to get the book from, Mrs. Leah can tell you a little bit about the fiction lessons that we have in there. So once a fortnight on your timetable, you'll have a fiction lesson in our fiction room. So you'll come into here like you've just done now, and you'll hang your coat and bags up and have your lesson in the fiction room, and you'll be able to choose what you would like to read. It's your choice from our massive selection of books. We have lots of different genres for you to choose from. And then you sit down and you read your book. And then at the end, you come and see us at the counter and you can borrow the book. And you can take them home, which is great. Hi, I'm Mrs. Parry and I'm a PE teacher. I'm head of PE at Brimsham. Come with me and I will take you to your lesson. So here we are at the sports hall. This is where you will come for all of your P lessons and you'll line up outside the changing rooms. We've got the girls on this side and the boys on this side. We're going to go through the girls' changing rooms a little bit tidier and show you inside. Okay, so when you let in for your lessons, this is where you'll come in, you'll get changed nice and quickly before your PE lesson starts. Also, we'll take the register and then take you through either into the sports hall, out on the field, out on the courts, or down to the track, depending on what activity you're doing for your lesson. Okay, so I'll take you into the sports hall, where you'll have quite a lot of your PE lessons. So, in here, as you can see, we've got quite a big space. We do lots of sports in here, such as badminton, basketball, um, netball sometimes inside if it's a bit miserable outside, a bit too wet. We've got indoor football. Hello, my name's Mr. Williams, uh, and I'm very pleased to meet you. And we're out here on what we call the tennis courts. And here is where you, you will be able to come every lunchtime, every break time, to run around, to sit down and relax, and to have fun with your friends. I like to do a few things out here. I've played catch a few times. And my favourite is football. I don't usually play catch with this. I like to kick it. Which you can do out here, because football's the best. And if you really, really enjoy football, which I do, this is the place to come. And in May, you will be allowed to come out here. Um, you are allowed to play football, only football, but there are goals to choose from. You don't have to put a bag on the floor. You can kick the ball around. You can play a proper game with your friends. There's loads of space out here. Really popular. You're gonna love it. I look forward to seeing you out here. So here we are in our studio. Um, we sometimes call it the dance studio, the fitness studio, 
studio because we do both activities in here. Um, girls, we do a, a lot of dance in the curriculum, but we also have an extracurricular dance club which is open to girls and boys, and we'd like lots of boys to come along. And um, that's just one of the things that we do extracurricular. We do loads of sports throughout the year, and it changes depending on the, uh, the season of the sport. So we'll do rugby, football, netball, it'll change then. We do rounders, athletics in the summer. Um, and lots of different other ones as well, such as badminton. And you can just come along, get involved, or try and represent the school in the many competitions that we do. So now I'm going to take you back out through the changing rooms and show you the English block. And the English block is just right outside here. Year six, my name's Mrs. Hamill and I teach in the English department. I'm really looking forward to meeting some of you and teaching you next year. Bye! Hi, I'm Mrs. Tapstills, I'm an English teacher. Really looking forward to seeing you in the autumn and hope I get to teach you then. Hello, my name's Miss Ash, I teach English in M1 and I can't wait to meet you all in September. Hi, I'm Miss Ginnan and I'm a music teacher here at Grimshaw Green. We're really used to our department being really busy, full of instruments and children, so we're really looking forward to meeting you in September. This is one of the practice rooms we've got at Grimshaw. We do a lot of group work, we've got drums, we've got keyboards, guitars, ukuleles, and we tend to let you sort of go off and have freedom with your friends and do some group work. Hello Year 7, my name is Mr Mills, I've already got to know most of you from your primary schools and I am transition lead at Crimson Green School, uh, but I also teach food preparation and nutrition. Here at Grimshaw Green School, you'll do loads of familiar subjects such as English, maths and science, but also you'll get to experience art, design technology, as well as food preparation and nutrition, lots of creative subjects that you can experience. In food preparation and nutrition, you get to make loads of different dishes throughout the whole year. So you can make bread rolls, pizza, and my personal favourite, hot cross buns. So on your marks, get steady and bake. Welcome to art. You might have done some art at primary school, but obviously at Brimpton we're going to be uh, sharing some of the amazing techniques that you've already got. We use oils, watercolours, clay, 3D design, and we're really looking forward to sharing some of our artwork with you. Hi, I'm Mrs. Goodless from um, Art Design and Technology, known as ADT, um, and just want to say I'm really looking forward to teaching you come September. Hi, my name is Mr. Marsh, and welcome to Design Technology and Engineering. In this building, we have a range of activities that we do. So in design technology, you get to use a range of exciting equipment and machinery. So for example, we do welding, we do drilling, we use a range of hand tools, and we use the brazen part. Looking forward to seeing you all in September. Hi, Year 7. Welcome to Brimsham. Um, my name is Ms. Revens. I'm an English teacher, but also I'm an assistant head. So I'll either have the pleasure of perhaps of teaching some of you English, or you'll see me along with the other SLT out on duty at lunch and break time. We're always out and about to hear your questions, to talk to you, see how your day's going, and just to catch up, really. So come with me, and I'll show you one of the most important places in the school. This is our dining room. This is where students who have a packed lunch um, come to eat. Um, obviously, we've got really big grounds, so if it's sunny, there's lots of picnic benches for those who have packed lunch to come and eat um, in those places. And there's always um, somebody here from the catering team offering sandwiches, etc. So that at this counter, you can buy, it might be cho chocolate flapjack, or it might be a sandwich, or it might be... Um, Toast at break time, um, but it's really um, a popular place to be. Okay, so if you want an alternative to the youth wing and you um, have a free school meal, or if you want to buy a hot meal, this is where you come. So I'm going to take you over to our other dining room. So at 
lunchtime you can queue from here to get into the dining room. Um, obviously it offers lots of different foods for you to pick, uh, choose from. My favourite is the lasagna, uh, absolutely delicious. And again there'll be staff here um, passing people through into the canteen. And as you can see through here, lots more places for you to sit and eat that very important lunch. It's my favourite time of the day in school. So when the bell for lunch rings, um, you will come down to the canteen, uh, you'll queue, there'll be members of staff outside um, supporting you with that, and then you'll queue here and you go in this door, and then you'll see all the serving and the um, dinner ladies there, and then you go walk through, we pay at the end, There'll be a till at the end, and then you come through this door, which will be open, and then you can either obviously choose to sit in here and have your lunch, or if it's takeaway, you can take it out and sit somewhere, you know, nice in the grounds. So if you want to eat your lunch outside, there are loads of places around Bridgeton you can go, and this is just one of them. But this bit's great because even if it rains, you stay dry. Or you could eat your lunch here. You could eat your lunch outside the maths and science department. Or here. Or in the summer, you can sit out on the field. Great. You could eat your lunch here. Or here. Or here. Hi, my name's Miss Hewitt and I'm one of the assistant heads here at Brimsham. Um, I'm really looking forward to meeting you when you arrive here um, in the new term. Um, some of you may have um, met the heads of house and um, Mrs Maddox and Mrs Salis um, in various other parts of the video and they might have talked to you about the house system and student leadership and tutor time. Um, that's my area of responsibility as well as um, anything to do with safeguarding. So I will get to know some of you um, over the next few weeks and months and I really look forward to that. We're just going to make our way over to um, the maths department now. So this is the maths department. Um, you're in for a real treat with maths at um, Brimsham. It's a it's a great department, and you'll um, you'll you'll have a really good time learning lots of different things to do with with maths. Right, I'm going to take you over to the resource base now. Head on in into the resource base. Hi, welcome to the resource base. My name's Mrs. Frankham and I'm the manager here. The resource space is used mainly for students who have additional needs, but our door is always open. The TAs often hang out here at break and lunch time when they're not in lessons, so if ever you feel you need to chat, you know where to find us, and we'll see you in September. Hi, I'm Miss O'Brien. I'm Mrs. Bosaith. And we're both TAs. And we look forward to seeing you in September. Bye. Okay, let's go down to science then. Oh, hello there. My name's Mr. Titley. I'm, I'm the head of science at Brimsham Green School. Just busy burning things. That one was uh, sodium chloride. I like to make pretty colours because science is fun. Um, we can't wait to have you here at Brimsham Green School where you are going to have an opportunity to learn all about biology, chemistry and physics and just generally get to do loads of cool practicals like this one. Um, if you particularly like uh, living things, you might want to find out how they work. If you're you're brave enough you to do a dissection, um, or you could uh, use the Van de Graaff generator and make your hair stand on end, which is also pretty awesome. I'm just trying to get this dipped in here because I particularly like this one. The colour's quite pretty, if I remember rightly, but if it doesn't work, there we are, look at that. 
anyone who's a fan of Maleficent Mistress of Evil will understand all the Sleeping Beauty movies, why this is so awesome. So, really looking forward to you joining Year 6, Future Year 7, can't wait to see you and have a great summer. drama lessons. This is the drama hall and you will have your assemblies here um, but also more importantly you will have a drama lesson every week where you work in groups and I'll teach you all sorts of different skills and hopefully you'll have loads of fun. You will also have the opportunity to take part in our amazing school productions. You might have seen some of them. We did Red last year and Les Mis and Oliver and Wizard of Oz um, and we love to have Year 7 joining um, and really getting involved. So we look forward to that. I hope you're having a lovely summer holiday and we will see you in September. Hi there, I'm Mr. Martin. I'm one of the assistant head teachers and I'm also proud to be part of the drama department here at Brimsham where we put on fantastic productions. Hopefully you'll be part of those and hopefully I'll get to teach some of you. When students come to us, one of the most common questions they ask is, where can I go to the toilet? So I'm going to show you because there are several places. Follow me. So if you need to go during break and lunch time, there's always one here, these are always open. You can go in here at breaks and lunch times. The other places to go for the most part are up at the canteen and at the youth wing. So there's one in there. And this way. Form. When you can stay with us and remain in the sick form, you'll get to use some toilets in here, but they're only for sick formers at the moment. Okay, look forward to seeing you in September. So this is one of the entrances to Brimsham Green School. This is what we call the side entrance. Um, you come down Broad Lane and it will take you into the school this way. A lot of you will ride your bike or walk in from this direction, especially if you're coming from the Brimsham area, which is back there. Now once you get in through this gate, it's really easy to find everything. I'll just turn the camera around and show you, but if you follow me like this and we walk down here, you will see how quick and easy it is to get to the bike sheds if you are bringing your bike in and the direction in which you need to go to go towards the drama hall. So as you can see, this is one of our several bike sheds just here where you can leave your bike. We recommend you bring in a padlock to lock up your bike for the day. If you follow me just down here a little bit further, you will see how easy it is to get to the drama hall and other areas of the school. And it's just to this point here where you will need to go on your first day. And just there we have the drama hall. If you are travelling to school by bus, this is where the bus stop is, okay? It will drop you off here and we'll pick you up at the same point. Once you've got off the bus, if you walk straight down there and turn left, you will find yourself at the drama hall, which is where you need to go on your first day. If you are being driven to school, this is where you get dropped off, just in the drop-off point here. The cars will pull in, just pull into the side there, let you out, and you can obviously get your lessons as quickly as possible. So year six, we've come to the end of your tour. It's been lovely having you with us. We really hope that you feel so much more confident about finding your way around. Because we know one of the questions that we get asked a lot is, I'm gonna get lost, I'm gonna be late to my lessons, what will my teachers do? 
don't need to worry. Your teachers know that you will be finding your feet in the first few days, so please do not worry about that. The only thing I want you to be thinking about this summer is, I cannot wait to get to Brimsham. I'm gonna have a brilliant time when I am there, and I have got all of these questions about learning that I cannot wait to ask my teachers. So, get your school uniform ready, get your bag packed. Until then, take care.